We love our pets and they love us, but let's face it, they can be expensive. So why not use your policy to cover those pet expenses? Because you're gonna have to pay for it anyway. My name is Carmen. And I'm Darius. For the best infinite banking and financial advice, subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit that notifications bell so that you're notified when we upload new videos. It's true, pets can help us lower stress blood pressure, risk of heart attack, and risk of stroke. Yeah. But sometimes they do get into things and an unexpected trip to the vet hospital can be a pretty penny. I was talking to my sister the other day and this is exactly what happened to her. By the end of this video, you'll know exactly how to use cash value life insurance to finance just about anything. So here's an example. Let's say that your dog ingests something that it can't go out the other way. So your dog has to undergo surgery in order to remove whatever he ingested. So you have a few options. You can either put that money on your Amex, you can use the in-house financing through the vet, or you can use something called a whole life insurance policy and use the cash value from that to pay for those medical expenses. Now, why in the heck would anybody want to use their whole life insurance policy to finance something that they would have to pay for anyway? Mm -hmm. Exactly that point. You're going to have to pay, pay for, for it, it anyway. anyway. <laughs> <laughs> and you might as well make money from it. So why not use your policy to fund your pet's expenses? So comment below and share a story of an emergency trip that you had to make to the vet. And make sure you check out the link above because there we talk about 10 ways you can use your whole life insurance policy. So here's exactly how it works. Let's say you have to take your pet to the hospital and it costs $2,000 for the procedure to be done. Well, if you use your credit card, according to wallethub.com, the average interest rate on a credit card is 19.24%. So that means that you would pay 20% over the cost of the surgery just to finance it using your credit card. Yeah. Now, the other option you have is in-house financing. You can talk to them and still you're gonna overpay for what it costs to actually do the procedure. So if you're gonna overpay it anyway by financing it, why not use your own banking system? You use these things to shop around a little bit to find what the best cost is. You're gonna take that cost and you're gonna use your whole life insurance policy and make those payments back to yourself. So by the time that you're done, not only do you have the savings replenished inside your whole life insurance policy, but you have all the money back that you use. And if something happens again, you can reuse that money and pay yourself that same interest rate because you're going to do it anyway. And another thing that's really nice about using your whole life insurance policy and shopping around different costs for financing is because now that you know exactly how much it costs to do these different things, now you can maybe finance it for someone else. Because since you're in the market for it, <laughs> I'm sure somebody else will be in the market for the exact same thing. And you know the costs. And now you've created a side hustle for yourself by lending money to other individuals so that you can help them cover their pet's expenses. Pretty genius. Because keep in mind, folks, when we talk about infinite banking, we're not talking about large amounts of money. We're talking about the money that you use day in and day out. We want you to learn how to recycle that money so mm -hmm. you can continue to replenish that money so that just gives you more and more money every single month, every single year to play with. Because think about the things that actually get us in trouble most of the time. It's the things that we don't plan for, yeah. which are things like emergencies, pets, car repairs, kids. All these things happen that we don't necessarily plan for, which means we get into trouble for it when we use a third party institution to finance it. So using your whole life insurance policy is amazing for just about anything and emergencies on pets are one of those things. Now the reason why we think it makes sense to have a policy designated for your pet's expenses is because these days so many companies are designated towards providing health insurance to your pets. Yeah, matter of fact, my sister, she has the option of adding her dog onto her health insurance plan. Yeah, through her company. So the world is changing, the world is evolving. So if pets now have health insurance, they don't have life insurance just yet, but that means you can create a saving plan for your pets. So when things come up, or even just the day-to-day -day expenses, pet foods, accessories. So it's all about creating a plan for your pets and having your money allocated appropriately. So now that you know our policies for pets technique, check us out on our Patreon page where we have a like-minded community of individuals who want to know all about infinite banking and how to work their policies. So we have this exact example on our Patreon community where you can see the numerical breakdown of how to use your policy to pay for your pet's expenses. 
And if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. And make sure you share it with a friend. And what do we do here on the Wealth Nation channel? We own our own lifestyle. Or someone else will.